All right, I'm back in the garage, as you can see. I haven't done a video in here in a while, so I just thought I'd show some, do an update on the doors. Um, still same openers, same doors, of course, but I'm going to run each door for you guys today. Or you can start by running the 8550 WLB, as usual. Why don't we get a view from right here? Um, we have the Rainer 893RGX here. We'll go ahead and run this up. Okay, and now we can go back down using the wall control. This thing is pretty quiet, I like it. All right, um, next we can go ahead and run my personal favorite, the LiftMaster 3850P. Um, for, you, for those of you that didn't know, this opener was, this opener here was the um, uh, older version of this one. So basically this model is the model that replaced this opener here. So um, in my opinion, this one is much better than that one because these ones get whiny pretty quickly if they're on a door that they don't like. Um, but these, they hold up pretty nice, and they are really quiet if the door is balanced. So we'll go ahead and open this up using the 98LM on the wall here. These things are fairly quick, too. This is a three-quarter horsepower DC belt drive. You know what, why not get an outside view? We have the, again, Rainer 893RGX. These are beautiful openers. There we go. This opener here actually broke last night on um, the pin holding the belt to the trolley uh broke off but we ended up getting it fixed we'll get an outside view of this one as far as speed goes I want to say the 3850 is a tiny bit faster than this. Why don't we go ahead and open up the 3255 that is hopefully getting replaced soon. Because this thing is loud and obnoxious. Okay, now we can go ahead and close this down. These are good openers at first. They're reliable. Um, some of them I've heard are pretty quiet. Not this one though. We'll close this one more time and that's gonna be about it. opener it, it, it is really nice all right that's gonna be about it for this video hope you guys enjoyed